Hi everyone. Uh, in this video, I'm going to demonstrate the use of the Mamaya Universal Press or Polaroid 600C horizontal mounted backs made by Analog Studio. That uh, would be me. So, this is how the back looks when you get it from Analog Studio, or this is how the back is going to look after you install the conversion kit from me. Uh, what's missing from here is a little dark slide, check dark slide reminder and a little count frame counter clock that I attach on top of it or not using double sided tape. So as you can see the top has replaced the possible lab this came this thing came from with a custom made adapter with the, has the claws and this particular back is for the Maya Universal Press. The Polaris Andre C looks identical and it has claws for only that it has claws for Polaris Andre C and the little gap in the middle and a different spacing. So that's the Maya Universal Press I'm gonna use and this is the back. So the way this mounts is horizontal. That means it's gonna go like that. You want the eject slot on the left side towards the handle and I'm going to tell you why is that. It doesn't really mount the other way. It has blockers here. So you want to put it like that. It's going to sit, gently sit on the claws. There should be no movement on your side and it should be pretty flush and then lock it. One and on the left side. The polarizer and this is a different type claws, you know those two handle claws. And you have to push them on both to lock. And you want to have here positive lock even if it's a little tight. Alright, so that's mounted already. So what do you do with this? Well if we had a let's say you insert a pack. <sighs> this is a used film pack, so let's assume this the first one is the film dark slide. So what you want to do is insert this like that, film or dark slide, the film dark slide towards the lamp. Make sure it goes in all the way. Close it. And then if this is a fresh pack, you want to use the eject button, press this with your nail. And this would be the first dark slide, you push it out. But if it's not the first pack, this would be a photo. So what you want right now, it, it, this is a regular film pack. What you want right now is the back comes with the dark slide. So in order to shoot photos, you want in order for your film to reach, in order for light to reach the film, you want to reject the back dark slide. So take it out this way. You see it's registered, it has a plastic lip. This lip, when you insert it back, has to point uh, towards you, towards the photographer. Not like that, you want it like this. Because, because of the back construction, it's simply not gonna go the other way. So it's not gonna go all the way in, that means it's not gonna act as a perfect dark spot. So when you put it back, you wanna make sure you put it back the same way you took it out is this way. So when you do this, you might hit the, this edge here, just lift it up a bit and then push it all the way. It should go this way. Okay, so let's take this out now. Cut the shoulder. Focus. And shoot. After you shot a photo, you're ready to eject. And this should be press the take button. Should be a photo. You have to put it face down. This particular Polaroid back does not have a, a tongue frog. Most of them do. And put it face back, wait for development, and you know what to do with the Polaroid print from now. Now 
Of course, when you do this, because check, check sideways, that means the chemistry is going to be on the side of the photo. And the question is, what do you do if you want the chemistry down? Well, in order for chemistry to be down, this needs to be checked up. So what you do is simply rotate the camera this way in portrait position and take a photo this way. Unfortunately, because of this protrusion, this will prevent the camera to be tripod mounted and heavy unless you have a really low profile tripod head. And there are things like that, that you can actually mount here. They will leave enough space for this to be tripod mounted. So if you want a regular oriented Polaroid print, you have to shoot this way. And if you shoot this way, you're going to get a sideways Polaroid print. All right, so suppose we're done with shooting and you want to switch the back to film back or you just want to take the back off and put it in storage while you still have filming it. Don't remember to put the dark slide back in. Again, this leap towards the photographer, away from the lens. Like that. It's going to hit here, lift it up a bit, push it all the way in, you're done. And for Mama and Bar Suppress, push these little silver buttons on one side, unlock it, push the silver button on the other side. This guy here, unlock it, and gently lift the back off. And you're done. This is everything inside, so on and so forth. You can reuse it, put it back, and don't forget to take out the dark slide when you actually want to take a photo. That's it. Bye.